Hello, how to solve for s in this equation, s to the power of square root of x is equal to 10. But before we proceed, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Take note of this that if you have s square square root, this is equal to s. Therefore, the all of this can be written as square root of s square to the power of square root of s this is equal to 10. take note of this that if you have a to the power of m to the power of n this is equal to a to the power of m n then this can be written as square root of x to the power of 2 square root of x is equal to 10. Now let square root of s is equal to y now let's substitute here we have y to the power of 2 y is equal to 10. let's take the natural log of both sides you have ln of y to the power of 2 y is equal to ln of 10. Now this can be written as 2y ln of y is equal to ln of 10. Now at this point we can apply our Lambert W function. And this is we have w bracket a e to the power of a is equal to a and in this case where a is equal to ln of y now let's substitute we have 2y ln of y is equal to ln of 10. Now we can divide both sides of this equation by 2. Let's divide this by 2. And this divided by 2. These two will cancel these two. Then we have y ln of y is equal to ln of 10 over 2. But we know that from here, ln of y is what? A. Then from our lambda w function, this is, we have l, n of y, e to the power of ln of y is equal to ln of 10 over 2. Now this is W bracket, then we have the ln of y e to the power of ln of y is equal to W bracket ln of 10 over 2. And we know we've introduced our lambda w function and the whole of this is ln of y then this is equal to w bracket ln of 10 over 2. then let's see this 
let's introduce the exponential we have e to the power of ln of y is equal to e to the power of w bracket ln of 10 over 2 and this we cancel this therefore y is equal to e to the power of w bracket ln of 10 over 2 but y is equal to square root of x then we have square root of s is equal to e to the power of w bracket ln of 10 over 2. Now let's square both sides since we are looking for the value of x. Now if you square the both sides of this equation, we have square root of s all square is equal to e to the power of w bracket ln of 10 over 2 or square this we cancel this s is equal to e to the power of w bracket ln of 10 over 2 or square therefore if you use calculator very well x is equal to 3.453 and this is the final answer we can check to confirm if this answer is right or wrong let's check to check we have the given equation s the power of square root of s is equal to 10 when s is equal to 3.453 here is 3.453 to the power of 3.453 then square root this is approximately equal to 10 therefore the left hand side 10 is equal to the right hand side which is this 10 which is true i hope you enjoyed the video thank you for watching please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe bye bye